Hi there, my name is Mark and I will be showing you a tutorial on Google Docs and the Google Docs interface. I'd like to begin by explaining a little bit how Google Docs works. Uh, as you can see, I loaded up Google Docs interface in my browser. You can see up here there's my Firefox browser window. And since I loaded it up in my browser, it is a web-based software and it sits on the Google server instead of on your own computer. This gives you many different advantages, but the main ones are that it is highly stable. Uh, you, you will rarely lose your uh, document uh, as long as your browser holds up. Uh, it saves to the server, so you will always have your changes saved, and if you uh, ever need to access a document, you can always find it on the server. It gives you the ability to collaborate and share. You can work with other people on creating your document. It allows you to publish to the World Wide Web and it also integrates well with other Google applications. Now on the Google interface, uh, the top bar has several different other Google applications and if you uh, move over to the more, you can see some of Google's other uh, software programs and if you hit even more, you can see that Google has a lot of software to access and and what's what's really cool about Google software is just about all of it is free and you can see here's Google Chrome the new uh, browser that Google came out with moving on we have the, uh, the right side of the top bar it just has a few uh, tools to work offline, your settings for Google Docs, uh, your help buttons, and sign out. Uh, the Google Docs logo is your click to get home. This brings you back to your main ho home page whenever you're uh, on other pages within Google Docs. You have the ability to search for documents. When you get a lot of documents that you're sharing with other people on your computer, you can uh, search documents by name or title or however you code your documents. Uh, it shows search options and then you can also save your searches. The blue bar is the main uh, toolbar for Google Docs. Uh, under new you have the different Google applications. You have your word processor, your presentation software, your spreadsheet, and form software which is brand new. The form allows you to create different types of surveys, quizzes, uh, many different things you can use with the form. And then down below you have all the Google templates and last count there was over 300 templates uh, that you can use that uh, will help you get started with a Google Docs project. You can upload other files uh, from other applications like Word and Google will convert them to a Google Doc. So if, if you have documents that you want to put into Google Doc, you can upload them here. Uh, you have the ability to share documents and collaborate with other people on projects through Google Docs. And that's one of the best features that uh, Google Docs has. Uh, you have the ability to create files in your main uh, storage window and store documents. You can hide documents in other files so you can't see them on the on the. Uh, main page, you can delete documents, you can rename, and all of these uh, you have to click and choose which document you're working with, uh, and then the more actions you can do some other neat things, you can save to PDF, to PowerPoint, to text, you can change owners, you can publish your doc, you can manage your sharing, and so on. Now the, the main access page to your documents is right here and uh, it's the biggest area in the interface and you can star documents to flag them however you want would like to sort them uh, you can select them for deletion or uh, other manipulating uh, tasks that you need to perform and you can store you can sort them by name by folder and by date opened and on the left is your navigation uh, for for your folders and, and your, your files. Uh, here's all the documents that I have created, owned by me. Here's the ones that I have opened, which may include someone else's documents. 
down below you have uh, new folders uh, you can save by item type uh, find by item type and then you have a list of the documents and the people that you share your documents with well that's the first tutorial uh, for Google Docs uh, the next one will be about uh, creating a Google Doc and collaborating with other people I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and uh, we'll see you on the next one thank you